If you want to record phone calls on Motorola Edge 60 Fusion, first you can check if you have the built-in option to do so. In this case, during the ongoing call, you should be able to tap on more in the call menu in order to find the record uh, record call option. However, there is a chance that you won't have this option, and that is because in some regions and in some countries, um, this option is not accessible. However, it is still possible possible to record phone calls. However, we need to download a third-party app that allows us to do so. So we're gonna go to the Play Store. Over here, let's search for an app that allows us to record phone calls. In my case, I'm gonna use Cube ACR. It is a simple app that allows you to even automatically record phone calls. So let's install it. I'm gonna show you how to set it up. However, in case you don't like this app for some reason, you can try another different app. So let's open it. First, let's gonna we're gonna press next, and then we need to grant permissions. There you go. Now over here we can disable power optimization by pressing OK and then allow. Over here we can disagree to geotagging and then press got it. Over here we can press X twice in the top left corner to skip the premium offer. And then we need to install the helper. So you should open the uh, website in the browser and here we need to select helper APK. Now you will see this information that file might be, might be harmful but we're gonna download anyway. And let's open and let's install. In the meantime, you might need to grant the access for the browser to install apps from unknown sources. Uh, but it is fairly easy. You will see that on the screen that you can jump to the appropriate settings in order to allow that. All right, let's open the helper. And over here, once again, we're gonna proceed, press next and grant permissions. Now let's select go to accessibility. Over here we need to tap on the Cube ICR app connector in order to see this message and then let's press OK and let's go back. Now we need to go to apps and then over here we need to find the Cube ACR helper. Tap on these three dots in the top right corner and then choose allow restricted settings and verify yourself. Let's go back. Once again choose to go to accessibility and this time we can go to Cube ACR app connector. We need to enable it, press allow. Over here we can press OK and allow. And now it is pretty much set up. Now we can open Cube ACR, we can go to the main app. Over here in the top left corner we can tap on these three lines in order to find additional options. We can make sure that recording is enabled. We can also go to recording settings in order to, um, to adjust the app to your needs. However, the app is pretty much ready to go. So now if there is a call, in this case we have automatic recording. But if there is a call and if you answer it, after a few seconds, you should be able to immediately start recording automatically. Let's go to notifications. And over here, as you can see, we have the information about the Cube ACR being active and that the automatic call uh, recording is in progress. So this is how we can make phone call recordings. Once you are done with the call, once it ends, you should be able to open the app in order to find the recording over here. In case the quality is um, not great, then you can try to use the app with the loudspeaker, meaning that during the phone calls you can use the loudspeaker in order to try to get better quality. Over here on the left side we can tap on these three dots in order to find additional options that might be helpful. Of course we can play the recording over here. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye!